got to look at the temp before I left this morning. All I know is it's freaking cold. Holy moly. Truck's being slow to warm up too. <laughs> Jesus. Well, we got the valve already. All the way here from Rhode Island already. That was fast. That's for the little engine, which I don't know. But right now, this is what our weather looks like. There is no wind. Uh, it's not showing up on the camera, but over here is the ethanol plant. And it appears that we got it. What wind there is, it's coming out of the southwest. Uh, yeah. Damn, I'm cold. Oh, there. Finally, the heat's coming out of the truck. But, uh, yeah, this is what it looks like so far. Yeah, let's see. Maybe you can see it now. That's it. Yeah, you can see the steam there now coming from the ethanol plant. That's going northeast. What breeze there is is out of the southwest. And, uh, school, I guess, is getting out at 1230. Because we are just supposed to get slammed today. Uh, anywhere from 6 to 14 inches is what they're talking, I guess. Wind chill factors of minus 35. Uh, and uh, 35 mile per hour winds. If we get any snow with that 35 mile per hour winds, this area is going to be shut down. So, I had a couple of bolts that I lost to the well, small engine I'm going to run over and see if we can find those. Depending on weather-wise, we'll see what we can get done today. All I know is I'm not going to get my butt stuck out at the farm in a blizzard. Because that would not be good. And uh, i got to go make partial payment on the house, too. I don't have all the house money, but... One way or another, I'll get this straightened out. I'm glad when I got the Tahoe paid off and the house paid off and no more payments and the money we get, we can actually live with instead of giving it to somebody else. So, oh, damn. You guys know it's cold. You've seen me running around with my coat open most of the winter. And I am cold. So, might get a, if I do it, might get to, uh, videos today um, well actually three if I if I get real ambitious I guess I want to be here you know, if you're watching this I did one on uh, just talking and being myself then uh, work on the Vortec and then a little Tecumseh replacing the valve and that so uh, yeah wow. anyway I'll go see if I can find some bolts quick and uh Go from there. I, I know I gotta write this stuff down, but I don't want to become a scripted per person doing this stuff. But just remember something else I was gonna tell you. Uh, in the video, I said something about the valve stem seals are missing. Well, I almost goofed. I didn't. Thank God I didn't clear out my emails because I would have been screwed. Because uh, I finally found the number, called the place, and said, "Hey." Well, I called the number on the box. They said, no, you got to talk to the gal that you bought it from. She don't work for us. She, we drop ship for them. Okay, well, if you guys drop ship, then you're obviously the ones that packed it. But anyway, uh, I finally got a hold of her and said, hey, I got that. that told her, and she's like, yeah. I says, well, on the box it says the valve stems are included. Well, they ain't supposed to be. And she got looking, she read and that, and she goes, huh. She says, well, on our notes it says they're not included. She said the rear main wasn't included, but we throw that in. In the set, I said, yeah, I, I got that. But I said, on the box, the only thing that it says it's not included is the timing cover because on those Vortex, it's a plastic cover, and you got to buy the whole cover to get that resealed. She says, okay, well, we want you to be happy. So they are sending me out a 20-pack of the Valstone sales. Well, what did I just say? A 20 pack of the valve stem seals. 
I'm not sure what I said. Anyway, <laughs> it's Monday. Brian's not working. It's froze. And, uh, yeah. Uh, well, anyway, yeah, she's sending those out, so. Which is okay. I'm about a day or so away from needing them, and if the weather changes, yeah, it could be a couple days, because if we get that snow and the wind, I don't even want to know what it's going to look like. It's going to be like winter has returned like it used to be when I was a kid, so. Well, alright. That's it for now. I'll be back. Here it is, 10.39 a.m., and look, it, it's starting to snow. Uh, just in the time I drove over here, it started. Oh, boy. It's going to be interesting, so. Alright. So, well, picked up some oil for the truck and another contraption for what they wanted. I couldn't build it, so. Uh, yeah, stop them. Throw some money at the house, and uh, we're gonna go to the farm for a little bit. So, just have to keep an eye on the weather today. Well, the store was in, they had it on, had the radio on, and a lot of schools are already calling off, so. It'd be nice if it didn't get as bad as they say, and just spooked everybody, but. I don't know. It just feels different about today, so. All right, we'll be back. Notice something here now. This storm's supposed to be coming out of the northwest, moving to the southeast. Um, right now, I notice the wind is going to the northeast. So I don't know. It's 11:09 now, and our visibility is—it's still about a mile, but it's it's dropping. So. We'll get out to the farm and do what we can and see what happens. So, see if I can get you guys a couple of different videos for the day. So, who knows? Anyway, um, yeah, I guess when we get to the farm, I'll talk to you there. So, all right. Well, I tell you, I like that black paint I got. Look at that. That is, <laughs> that's nice. Here's what I got. That's one of the nice. It's even good to 500, 500 degrees. So, yeah, I know I'm bad at showing you guys labels and that. But anyway, well, I'm just going to do a little more talking here. God, I it just it's going to be looking pretty sharp here. Oh, yeah, I talked about that. The seals. Oh, just to show. You guys, too, to make sure I didn't misread the box. Come on. Okay, come on. Hear me. Okay. See, it says set includes valve seal, stem seals. She said it wasn't supposed to. So they went ahead and sent it to me, and it says right there, does not include. But otherwise, it included all that. She's like, okay, well, she said it's thin enough. She said it must be a misprint on the box, or I don't know. But I did see it, so. Uh, anyway, they made it right. And I guess the number, if you take the number off this, that, I don't know if they actually sell to you or if they are only drop ship. So. Anyway, got that painted up. That's going to look nice. I am playing hell finding the softball kit, but I got a call place. So, we got the new valve. The exhaust has been lapped in. And it's not looking too bad. So, that's been lapped in. Now, I got the new one here. So, that came all the way from Rhode Island. Oops, look out, kitty. I know the weather's going to do something. The animals are goofy. And it's snowing lightly right now. 
Thank you for doing that. Remind me, I gotta turn you down. Anyway, well, let's see. Let's check out the new valve compared to the old valve. So, all right. And that's my new guys. Ah. I forgot to turn around and see what you guys are seeing. All right. Lincoln Rhode Island is where this comes from. And I asked the guy if he had any more of these or what the deal was on him having these. He says, well, he bought out some new overstock. And I guess, and he told me, he said he got a hold of some stuff didn't know what it was and he was selling it and they're selling it cheap and a guy got a hold of him and said hey bud you better research what you got so the guy did and found out oh but the guy that notified him that he was too cheap on his stuff guess what he paid him full price so oh uh oh Up it is new. I was going to say at first it looked like the retainer was. That's a new valve, but the retainer just looks a little funky. But now yeah, the retainer was what the problem is. That was what the problem was. Now I get to set the clearances and. Check all that, but uh, yep, and there's all the how it snaps on there, just like that. <laughs> Wish it was that easy in the motor. But, uh, yep, there's our brand new valve, and this was an original Tecumseh part. So we got our valve here. We'll see if it uh, fits or if I'm going to have to uh, set the cap already. Okay. Same. Yep, it's too tight. Oh no. No, yep, it's touching, so I'm gonna have to ever so slightly take a little off that and get the gap set. Well, I gotta make sure it's at top bottom. You know, it should be because they're both closed. So wow, here's the difference. There's the new one in there. Watch when I spin it. They don't go different directions. Now here's the old valve. See it wobble? Yeah. So yep. That's that's good. So don't lose track of that. I don't know if I'm gonna work on that today. Work on the motor. I really don't want to get in the middle of a project and then have to quit because I got to fly home to get there before I get my butt stranded to here. So, I guess I'll get uh, decided what I'm going to do and uh, we're going to do it. Alright. This sucks. I'm sitting here waiting at the stop sign because my window is not playing nice to me right now. But, uh, it's blowing up pretty good there. So, uh, anyway, I guess uh, get this window thawed out. We start for home, and we'll get these two videos up for you guys. So, well, the weather gets any more, I'll videotape that, and that'll be in tomorrow's video or so. 
uh, probably about running the day late, so I want to call this video done too for today. Get this window thawed out and get my butt for home and be ready to push some snow, I guess. So, all right, well, y'all take care, have a good one, and God bless each and every one of you, and stay safe in this weather. And take care. I hope I can remember to put this with the other video. So, here it is, one o'clock, and here's what is going on. Here's what's already built up on the windshield. That's what I figured. Froze. So, yep, I'm turning chicken, guys. I'm sorry, I'm heading home. <laughs> and if I remember to do this correctly, this will be a two part video. We got a little more work done on the 350, but uh, I'm not getting to where I wanted to be today. But I'd rather be home with the wife and kid instead of stuck out here with no food, no medicine, no nothing. So, hey, 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 getting a little drifts on the road already. So, yep, winter is trying to make its appearance, and if we get as much snow as they're talking, it's not going to be good. So, and right now our snow is coming out of the south, southwest. Come on. There's the window. So, alright, well, we're fogging over here and uh, we're going to go home. I get windows cleared out, bring you back.